Hey kids, it's Mr. Dan the Art Man back with a brand new video. Today, we're going to draw Frankenstein's Monster. That's right, Frankenstein's Monster. This is a fun, easy drawing that you're going to have a lot of fun with. So, um, let's get started. Today, all you're really going to need is a pencil, maybe an eraser, um, and then later on, you're going to need some colors. You might want to have a black permanent marker for some at some point, or a black marker to outline your work. Today, I'm going to draw with a marker because it shows up better on the camera that we're going to use. So let's go ahead and get started here. Really simple drawing. Just by, by drawing a few basic shapes, we're going to be able to create old Frankie here. So the first thing that we're going to do, we're going to start by drawing a nice big U shape for the head of Frank of Frankenstein's monster. And we're gonna do that kind of towards the top of the page here, but we're gonna make sure we leave a little bit of space. Okay, so I'm gonna go right here. I wanna have a nice big round U like this, nice and wide, just like that. And then I'm going to draw a flat line here up top. Next, we're going to put a nice little jagged line from one side of our head to the other. And it's okay if it's not like perfect. Actually, you might want to make it imperfect. Frankenstein's hair wouldn't be perfect. Right? Then, I wanted to do a, a little line here. And on this line, I'm going to add some X's. This is where they put Frankenstein's brain in. Underneath that, another line. And put some eyes on there too. Nice little round nose. And then I'm going to do my mouth a little bit differently on this one. I had Frankenstein smiling in this one. But on this one, I'm going to do something a little bit different. He's going to be... I'm going to do a square mouth. Make him look a little more angry. Oh, and I can't forget to put the bolts on. Very important. Next, we're going to add his back. So, another just nice, big, upside-down U-shape, kind of like this. I'm trying to use the whole paper here. And then I'm going to do a line like this, and a line like this. This is going to be like the sleeve. So I'd like to come up and then down like this. And then here's another jagged line area. This is like the bottom of his clothes a little bit torn up. Now if you want to add some more stitches here, you can do that. And one thing I like to do is I might like to make his his clothes look a little bit torn up. So I might come along here and add a little patch. Maybe I'll do another one up here. So 
Let's finish up his arms here. Two little lines. I'm just gonna do something like that for the hands. Little thumb and a kind of like a mitten shape. Keep this kind of simple. Like that. Then I might as well add some legs here too while I'm at it. So just two little lines. Gonna add some feet here. Just something like that. I might just add a little line here to separate the ground from the sky. It gives my drawing a little bit of depth. And there you go. There's Frankenstein. Now I can add some color to this. Um, make it look a little bit more like this one, but you can do that on your own. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Until next time, remember, art is...